okay student in last video we discussed the concept of sequence and sequence we said that that is used to generate the unique value that is a database object another concept that is the identity identity is very similar concept used in oracle as we use in the auto increment in a mysql identity can be used as a for all of those attributes who are used as a surrogate key or as a primary key the value can automatically generate it in oracle identity can be generated using the three main concept that can be always that can be by default or that can be on null so whenever we have to use the identity so the value of the identity can be generated the identity attribute value can be generated instead of using dot uh, sequence name dot next value or sequence name dot current value identity we don't need to mention the concept of the dot next value we it will automatically generate it when we have to create the table so how we can use the concept of identity in oracle so here it is let i am creating create table name of table let we say that uh, department i am using it over here department id data type of this one is number now when i am using it over here number i want to generate this one value automatically using the auto increment concept or using the concept of the identity or we can use it over here for that one we have to use it over here generated generated always as identity now i am using it over here as identity i am not mentioning anything else so it's mean value will be generated for the department id and value will be start from the one incremented by one that is by default here we can use also start with and increment by so if we are not using it over here so by default it will take the initial value start value one and incremented by one so initially i'm not using it over here at this stage and next step we will use it over here the next values okay uh, next one we say that department id department names and this one is var char 2 size of this one is 30 executed table is created having the identity column and its value will be always generated as so let i have to insert the data insert and to table is here depth list of the columns i have to use i, I can't use the list of the column at over here the department id because i use it over here as the generated always as the value of the department id will always be generated by identity and identity value will be incremented by 1 and start with 1 first value is 1 then next is 2 then 3 then 4 then 5 that value will be generated in proper sequence then we have to use it over here the values i am using it over here department names computer science okay done value is one in that it no i we have to insert in other values insert into let table name is here department name of column is uh, depth name and then i have to use it over here the values we see that so math now let me check select strict from table name is here department check the value let's see it see that values are automatically generated by 1 and 2 now let we have to generate the value instead of always we are having another options that is a uh, default options by default so let's see let me first me drop the table drop table name of table 
depth value is dropped now i have to just uh, copy this one i am editing it and pasting it over here uh, lest i have to remove it over here two three four and five okay department id number generated what i see by default department names i am not making any change over here by default by default i am generated by default identity and for identity i am using it over there start with 10 increment by department id number generated by i am using it over there default identity start with 10 increment by i am using it over here 2 comma so you can see it over here that we are having the department id column whose value is generated by default it means if user is not the assigning the value so it will automatically take the value it will take the value of default value identity that will start with the 10 and increment it by 2 save it execute it okay generate it by default what we use it over here gen generated by default as identity we have to use it over here edit it generated by default as identity now close it now table is created now if i want to insert insert into table name is here department if I am using the list of the columns, let me say uh, I am using directly values. Values uh, for the department ID, I am using the value it over here is 1. Then department name, I am using it over here CS. So let's see. Values inserted. I am inserting in other records. Department ID 2. Name is here math. Okay. Values inserted. But let me use it over here instead of. Uh, list of the columns I have to mention it over here I am using it over here the department name and values so for department names I am using chemistry gem so value is, is inserted let's see now here we are having the default value that is start with 10 next I want to again uh, use it over here insert into department department names value values i want to use it over here and stuff uh, i'm using it over here english so values inserted now select static from we having the department so here we can see that first two values are here that we assign the value to over here one and two but when we are not assigning the value so it will take the by default value by default value is start with 10 and incremented by 2 so it take the value for these two records it take the value 10 then for the next one record it increment the value it use identity and increment the value by 2 the next value is 12 that's all concept related to the identity so we can use the concept of identity as uh, by default or generated always or we can use it on null we have the three different options that we can use is the concept of identity and moreover this one is used as a just like auto increment as we use in the mysql thanks for watching the video